Tom. Hi, both. How are you? Hi, Josh. Hi, Josh. So great to be speaking to you for this movie because I had such a good time with it. And Adessa, I wanted to start with you because Riley is such an interesting character and she seems to be really seduced by the temptation of the puzzle box. So what was your take on why she is so fascinated by it? Do you think it is her history or is it just the lure of what's inside? Um, I haven't heard that if it's her history. That's that's an interesting question. I think she's just kind of very attracted to shiny objects and the box is kind of a shiny object. And uh, yeah, so I mean, she's an addict. It's not about that she's an addict, but if she's going to start something, she's going to finish it. So it takes her on this journey and she does not want to let go of it. Even when there are times she probably wants to a little bit. She doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. And for both of you, I, I think it's fair to say the Cenobites are going to really just terrify people when they finally get to see them. But for you sharing the screen with them, what were some of those days like on set for you? It must have been quite an intense, weird sort of experience. Yeah. It was um, very strange. The, the Cenobites are all pretty much what you see in the movie is, is what they look like on set. And the Russells, the FX team, they were very specific in making everything practical and uh, real and tangible. Um, most of the time I felt bad, you know, we, we were like in heat yeah. and they had to be like in these incredible costumes. But I think even even the the players who were playing them were so like in awe and in fascination of the incredible work that went into creating them. Yeah. yeah. And they had to sit in that in that um makeup trailer and get get those suits on for like seven hours. Crazy. Yeah. So it was all very much right in front of you. It was incredible to look at. Yeah, I can imagine. Again, no spoilers, but obviously with a film like this, it goes without saying that you're getting hands-on with some blood and some gore throughout the movie. So it feels like there was a lot of, as you said, practical effects in the film. So for both of you, again, what was it like experiencing that and, well, getting bloody for this movie? I mean, I, I loved it so much, but at the same time, I hate working with blood. I hate it. I love it, but I hate it because blood continuity is such a big thing where it's like, no, 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 no. The, the, the blood mark was not here. It was here. It's like, uh, it's just, it, it, just so much detail goes into it, um, which is incredible that everyone like remembers that, but it's also the most stressful thing. And just to scrub that blood off, sometimes it's, it's like alcohol-based blood. So you just gotta, with alcohol, just get in there. So that, that was, uh, very um interesting <laughs> yeah, there were lots of days off with just like random blood spots still stuck on you <laughs> and... like I'll, you'd be walking to like go go buy a pack of smokes or whatever and someone's like are, are you okay and I'm like what and then like uh, what just like a giant like splatter of blood on my neck and I'm like oh it's it's fine don't worry they're like do you need me to call someone I'm like actually yes <laughs> can you uh Oh, how cool yeah, call sag <laughs> yeah call sag <laughs> something i really loved about the film as well of course is both your characters they have this obviously their siblings and this very complicated relationship they have before we really get into the horror of it also did you two both get to work behind the scenes on that and to, to develop some backstory or was what was in the script for you enough to, to go on to begin with we actually did kind of talk about that i usually don't really like to go like that crazy about like like figuring out my character's backstory because I kind of just want to like see what happens but we did talk about because you know our parents are never mentioned or anything so we did talk about that yeah I love talking about backstory so <laughs> I had all these questions um like, but so I think our mommy and daddy <laughs> yeah but I think the meeting of both Odessa and I's process like allowed for like what happens on screen to be very full and um i mean even that process of what she wants and what i want are very like indicative and mirroring of yeah, the of siblings our... themselves <laughs> um yeah. yeah that was oh. fun we you know we worked well together so we, we did had fun we on did. set and um yeah 
Oh, that's awesome to hear because I, I loved what you guys did in the film. And thank you so much for your time today. I cannot wait for people to finally see this one because what an awesome horror movie and hope to get you, hope to see you both come back maybe for more. So thanks so much. Thank you, Josh. Thank you. Nice to meet you.